Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's tutorial, I will be showing you how to get this cute holiday glam. It is so simple to do, like honestly, it is so freaking simple. It did not take me long at all. In total, it probably took me about 10 minutes to do my eyes. I wanted to pick out something that was very wearable and that everyone can wear and change up to how they like. So if you like this look and you want to learn how to get it, just keep on watching. I'm going to start going with some hourglass and I'm just going to rub that into my pores. I haven't really used this enough to know how well I like it, so I guess we're just going to give it another try today. I'm going to let that set into my pores just for a little bit before I put on my foundation just so it can be very, you know, flawless. I'm going to go in with foundation and I'm going to be using the Estee Lauder Double Wear in the color Rattan. Yeah, that, that's the name. Um, I'm just going to try to speed through this process because you guys seen me do my foundation application quite a few times. So, so for concealer, I'm going to go in with Maybelline Fit Me and this is in the color light. I'm basically just going to keep this color in the inner corner. And then I'm going to take the color sand and I'm going to just do it where I normally would. Then I'm going to take the excess and just go to my chin and slide to my mouth because they're ten they tend to be a lot darker. Now I'm going to go ahead and bake my under eye with some Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm just going to keep it very very close to my under eye. I don't really want to bake like how I normally would. I would go all out. I would usually normally go a lot further down but I'm not going to do that because I have a lot of dry patches under my eye area and I don't really want to accentuate them. I want to start baking the, I guess the high points of my face before I go ahead and set the rest of my face. I've been doing that a lot lately and I actually like the effect a lot better. And then I'm going to take a 125 brush by BH Cosmetics and I'm just going to just powder the rest of my face. Just so my foundation doesn't move around. Since this is holiday makeup, it should be able to stay on all night. Now I want to take a break from our face and I want to move on to our eyes. And lately I've been really loving this brush. It's a BH 130 brush and I've been loving this to prime my eyes. And it's just really quick and big and it covers a lot of surface area. And I'm setting my eyes with Maybelline Master Conceal. And I want to set my eye with my Morphe 350 and I'm just going to use the shade right here. The whitest shade at the corner. I'm going to go in with this color right here at the top and this is basically a perfect transition shade. And I'm going to pack that onto my crease. Next, I'm going to go in with this color right here, and I'm going to use my Little Elf Defining Eye Brush. This look is honestly perfect for someone just starting out makeup, or someone who doesn't really have that much time but wants to look like they put in a lot of time. It's very simple, and it's very quick. So I'm going to go in with this color right here, and I'm going to take my Elf Crease Brush, and I'm going to... Do the same thing I did, just basically keep this on the outer part of the eye and the inner corner of the eye. Now I'm going to go in with this shade right here. I'm going to be using my BH132 brush. And I just want to blend that out with my Real Techniques fluffy brush. And the last color I'm going to use from this palette is this color right here. I'm going to use that on a Morphe MB27. Now 
So the star of this show is going to be a ColourPop shadow, and this shade is called Telepathy. It's so pretty. It's like a green goldish shade, I would say. And I'm going to pop this on the center of my lid. And I'm going to take the crease brush that we used and just blend out the edges. Now I really want to use this chocolate shade and I'm going to put this under our lower lash line but I'm just going to keep it where the dark parts were so I'm going to go right here and right here so I'm going to take that color pop shade and put it on the center of our lower lash line so I'm going to finish up this eye and then I'm going to pop on some of my favorite lashes from Huda Beauty and it is Monique. So I'll be right back guys. Okay so the last thing that I want to do with my eyes, I want to go in with this ColourPop liner and it's in the color called Show Me. So to start off with our face, I want to go in with my NYX Contour and Highlight Palette and I just want to go in with this shade right here. And then to contour, I want to go in with this shade right here at the bottom corner. And I'm just going to be using my Real Technique Sculpting Brush. And I just want to stamp out the edge where my contour starts just to make that the darkest and the most defined. I want to take this brush. This is like the best blush brush. I literally just discovered it not so long ago. And it's the BH124 brush. This brush is amazing. And I want to go in with my favorite brush. The my favorite blush from e.l.f. and it's this apricot color right here. And I just want to look nice and rosy and flushed. Literally love this blush so much. It's very subtle, but it's very cute. We're going to move into my favorite part. So I'm going to use a couple highlights because, of course, I am extra, and that's just what I do. I love to glow. I'm going to go in with this middle shade right here from the Morphe palette, and I'm going to just highlight my face and give it a subtle glow. And the high points of my face, my chin, my cupid's bow. I literally want this, like, everywhere I could possibly get it because... Why not? And I'm going to take this down my nose. And then I'm going to take my fan brush, dip it into that same highlight, and I just want to connect my brow bone to this highlight right here. Because, you know, of my extraness, I'm going to wet my brush. And I'm going to dip into this bad boy. Look at it. Come on. Just look at it. It's already like glowing. God. And I'm going to keep this at the top of my cheekbone. Literally at the highest point of my cheekbone. So since we put on a lot of powders, I'm just going to set my face with some all-nighter setting spray. And this does not let me down. Like this won't let you down either. I highly, 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 highly recommend this. If you want your makeup to last all day, all night, you know, do its job. So the only thing left for us to do is go in with lipstick and I'm gonna use the ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in the shade Monday. Okay, beauty, so that completes today's tutorial. I hope you really like this holiday glam. It was very simple and easy to do, so I honestly hope you recreate it and try it out. I really hope you guys love it a lot, so I'll see you next time. Bye!